I'm excited about this walkthrough because it's gonna show you how to make extra money through your online galleries, and that's through setting up your store with CloudSpot. So let's get you rolling. You can quickly access your store in the top navigation here. Your first step is to connect with the service that we use to pay you instantly every time you make a sale. At the time of this recording, you'll see Stripe as the option to select here. You'll be able to log in if you already have a Stripe account, or you can quickly create one in just a few easy steps. It's nice because once you have it set up, you can forget about it and all of the sales will just go right into your designated bank account. Once you are connected, in your banking section, you can then change your currency and add any terms of sale. These terms will be shown to clients and they'll be required to agree to them before making a purchase through your gallery. So now that we've got the payment side of things squared away, it's time to create catalogs of the products you want to make available for purchase. There are two types of catalogs you can create and I'll walk you through each option. Let's start with the catalog type that's the easiest way to earn more money, and that's with auto fulfillment catalogs. Auto fulfillment means you get to set your own prices, but when it comes to printing and shipping, our partner lab takes care of all of that for you. Currently, auto fulfillment is only available in USD, so if you have a different currency set, then you'll want to use our custom fulfillment option. Custom fulfillment catalogs are different in two ways. One difference is that you can create and customize each product and price. And the second difference is that you are personally responsible for printing and shipping custom fulfillment orders to your clients. So the shipping section you see here in the store is only if you're using custom fulfillment. Otherwise, our partner lab already has shipping covered and your clients will see their available shipping options at checkout. All of your catalogs are housed in the catalog section on the left. And this plus sign is where you can click to create a new catalog. In the pop-up, enter your catalog name and then choose auto fulfillment. If auto fulfillment is grayed out, just check to make sure your currency is set to USD. For your auto fulfillment catalog, you have some extra options where you can add premium packaging to your orders or have the lab apply color correction to prints when they're ordered by your client. If you haven't calibrated your colors with this lab specifically, then we definitely recommend having color correction enabled. Both of these options do add a bit to the costs, but we leave it entirely up to you which ones you'd like to select. Now let's check out our new auto fulfillment catalog. You'll see the base prices set by the lab here, which you can mark up individually or by using the bulk markup option here. By default, we populate the catalog with the most popular sizes, but you can also add more options, if they're available from the lab of course, by clicking add product here. This is also where you can add any digital download products to this catalog. You'll select digital and then customize whatever digital items you'd like to sell. Whether you create an auto or custom fulfillment catalog, any digital purchases will automatically be sent to your clients at checkout. Keep in mind, no matter what type of catalog you create, you are responsible for setting up any applicable taxes, so let's navigate to that section next, right here. First, add a country by clicking the plus sign next to taxes, and then enter in the tax rate. You can then have it apply to shipping costs or digital sales if necessary. To create a regional tax, make sure you have the correct country selected and then click Add Region. You can then select the region and add any necessary information. I personally only set a regional tax rate, so I keep my country tax rate at zero, but set my regional California tax rate to my own individual county's rate. This is probably what you'll do, but we definitely give you the flexibility for both a country tax rate and a regional. The last section, which I hope you'll all get a lot of use out of, is your discount codes. Discount codes are a great way to increase your sales and incentivize your clients to order. Something as simple as giving your clients a time-sensitive code for 20 to 30% off of their order can really help jumpstart things, so definitely take advantage of it. I mean, why not try it, right? Uh, let's add a discount code by clicking on Add Discount Code in the top right. You input the name of the discount code and then generate the code itself, which you give to your client to use when they check out. Options for the code is to have it apply to the order total, just the shipping, or to just digital products only. You can make this also for a specific dollar amount or a flat percentage. There's also options to list a code expiration, minimum order amount required, max number of uses. You can totally customize a code to fit your needs. With just a few clicks, discount codes can be one of the biggest drivers of sales and I definitely encourage you to give it a try and also join our private Facebook community group to see what other photographers are doing to help boost their sales. Last, but certainly not least, now that you've spent this time setting up your store, don't forget to enable sales in the sales tab of your online gallery settings. 
And with that, you're done. As your orders start rolling in, you'll see them appear on your order section and you'll be able to dive in to see the details and statuses for every single order. As always, please do let us know if you have any questions by dropping us a message in our support chat. We're happy to help.